important. I feel it's the foundation for life. The foundation of our kindergarten day is the creative play. The day is very formed, but not like this. It's like a river that flows through the, the landscape of the day. We bake and we sing and we move and we draw and we work with beeswax and we listen to our stories. And so it seems like, oh, it's just having a lovely time, but it's very meaningful and very, very important to the development of a young child. Essential, really. Lucy is sitting on eggs because on the holiday the rooster came to visit so we might have baby chickens in the eggs. We followed the Northern European tradition of one teacher taking a class through the primary school. So when the children enter class one, there is one person who becomes their coach, their mentor, their guide, through this very crucial step in life, moving from early childhood before they reach adolescence. As well as that teacher, of course, there are many other teachers. We bring all the formal learning through the imagination, through images, through pictures. By being able to hear stories, by being able to sing and have poetry and have a rich environment in the classroom, the child is emotionally fulfilled in a way that is beyond just purely intellectual knowledge. This for them builds a wonderful intrinsic motivation to learn, a joy in learning that is quite unique to the way that we educate. You're very welcome and you don't feel like you're being judged and well, each teacher can help you individually and they know how you work and what helps you the best and they can provide the attention that you need. And it's just very like open and you can say, you can ask questions and you know you'll get an answer. Only I could have given him this wonderful moon. I like coming to the junior library to read books and there's lots to choose from. The curriculum's very age appropriate. We make sure that the things we bring to the children are at the right academic and emotional and social age for them. Our main lesson is a, a subject that is taught over a three week period. It's taught in such depth that the children have a chance to delve into all aspects of that subject. A good example of our main lesson is the Year 5 Ancient Greece story, where for three weeks the students are immersed in the world of Socrates, of Plato, of Athens, of the world of the ancient Greeks, this fundamental stage in human development. They look at the great myths, they look at the legends, they look at how democracy was born in this early time. They really experience a deep understanding of ancient Greece.